Back. I'm open. back. I'll bet his back gate's open too. I don't know what happened with that voice. It was just, it was okay, and then it wasn't, and then it was terrible. So, open that. It took me a while to actually find this, and it's a good. I could do with an anvil, but it might be useful. Uh, what's what's up here? Okay. This door's just painted on. I don't know. I mean, there is something there. What the fuck? I knew there was something creepy in there. The fuck? Okay, um... Let's see if Louie has any idea. Hey, what can I do for you, Mike? Okay. So, Rook? Yeah. Same old ornery cuss he ever was. Eh, don't bother me none. Nah, I guess I'm just used to it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And Zach? Uh, Zach don't come in here a whole lot. I guess he don't like my food much. Nah, he loves your food. Carlos? You wouldn't remember him. He moved into the neighborhood a few years back. Not a pleasant man. I'll leave it at that. Okay, Chelsea's death? I can't really talk about that. If she died the way the cops said she did, burned inside your speeder, it's just too much to think about. I keep a little hope that maybe she ain't dead at all. Or at least that maybe she died in a more peaceful way. That's still more than the cops told me about it. What about Holly? That Holly is a real spitfire. I don't know how I feel about the whole holograms of people too thing, but yeah, why not? And uh I'm no good with that computer the... stuff, but that little fella at the barbecue joint is a whiz. I'll bet he could get you taken care of. Alright. Cool. So that's Inspector Burns. Haven't barbecue? had another food joint on the street since Francesca ran the slice of heaven. Now, I thought it might cut into my business some, but not so far. Maybe we just don't have a lot of barbecue eaters around here. All right. So that's the barbecue place. As I step into Inspector Burns' barbecue, I think I'm having a stroke. But no, burning toast is their special today. Behind the counter is the kid who Louie referred me to as the computer whiz. Hello. Welcome to Inspector Burns Barbecue. My name is Mojo. Special today, so they come carnage. They'll destroy your hunger as well as your taste buds. Order when you're ready. Um, okay. Um, culinary colonoscopy. My hammy vice. A ham, cheese, and habanero corn dog, deep fried and wrapped in bacon. Does that come with a free colonoscopy? Hey, hey, you're, you're Tex Murphy. And you're Mojo. What a shagadelic name, baby, yeah! What was... What my real name is Mordecai Josephus. Are you serious? Well, that's my real name, too. No way! See, yeah, well, it's pretty close. Uh, it's actually Tiberius, uh, James Tiberius. And As in James Tiberius Kirk? Kirk? Well, I had to come up with something that I could live with. The ultimate... Tex Murphy trivia. You just made my day. That's Look, probably I don't mean not to geek out on true. Here, but you're Tex Murphy. 
badass private eye. Man out of time. Always quick with a joke or his fist. What are you doing in a dump like this? Um... Um... I don't know, uh, exterminator? Well, I wanted to find out what was incinerating all the cockroaches. <laughs> nice. Classic Tex Murphy. <laughs> uh, strike a deal? Maybe? I'll tell you what. You buy me lunch? Good quality. Oh, you don't want to eat here. The food really will burn your face off. Inspector Burns is a bitter, bitter man. So, what are you working on? Wait, let me guess. Some kind of case just dropped in your lap. Seems like a small time job, but there are tons of loose ends leading in all kinds of directions, and you are blindly getting nowhere. Yeah, that's a good guess. Well, yeah, that is kind of what's happening. Oh, I could help you. Um. Well, do you need someone to take care of that? No, the. <laughs> you are killing drive. me. Look, uh, Mr. Murphy, you fancy yourself as sort of a timeless classic, a PI archetype for the ages. You know your way around the crime scene, but it's no secret that you're not so good at high-tech gadgets. That's where I come in. Okay, yeah. Fine. I have a fax machine, for God's sake, and I barely know how to use that. Whatever I can do, just let me know. I have this encrypted memory stick. Sure, I can decrypt the memory stick, no problem. It may take a while, at least a day. All right. Let's talk about like this place. Like Inspector Burns says, it all tastes the same when your tongue's charred. That's technically true. Okay, Ruck. Comes in here all the time to eat, just so he can complain. Yeah, it sounds like Ruck. And Zach? He says he likes barbecue, so I'm not sure why he eats here. Not exactly another barbecue place around here. Carlos. He's the guy you hired to take photos of your cheating wife. You're the guy they hired to beat the crap out of the guy you catch with your wife. And what about Chelsea? Chelsea Bando. The Nora to your Nick. I wish I could have met her. What about her death? Sorry you lost her, but man, did you ever get an attitude? What about Holly? Sometimes I spend hours just thinking about what kind of baby she and I would have together. Okay. Um, how about Louie? Inspector Burns has tried to torch the Bruins to do at least twice. <laughs> okay. So Christ glad Midnight. Archie opened up his shop here. He's like a god at all this conspiracy stuff. Okay, so... Archie runs the three cards to midnight. Yeah. Me and Archie are buds. Okay. And I me? just can't believe I got a chance to meet my idol. Okay, okay, that's not that much. Okay, um. Another leaving. item on my to do list today is checking out Maldonado's regular office that's on the street. Alright, and that is over here. Uh, what the hell is that? That's a spo pad, protecting the universe from imperfect life forms since 1967. It's like a mall cop with a 5,000 meter volt taser without a moral code. Be careful, Tex. I could get hurt. Uh-huh. Hate to short out Tom Servo. So that anvil that I got, this is why. <laughs> Apparently I disappeared while I was doing that. Wow, nothing is so simple and wonderfully effective as blunt force trauma. I'd say. It's locked. I won't be able to enter without proper identification. Well, that's convenient. Wow, a place even sleazier than yours. And you have an animal print bedspread. Uh -huh. That is. Emily? I hope she's doing this to get through school. Um. 
Oh wait, what's this? Hello? Could I speak to Carlos Tex? Hi. Sorry, have we met? Apparently so. That woman knew me, but hung up quickly when she realized I didn't know her. If we can find her, maybe we could get some answers. She must have visited Chandler while she was doing business with Maldonado. Maybe someone around here will recognize the photo. Okay, so that's already a lot more than What's this? what I got before. I didn't actually find that earlier. So... Yeah, I... Hmm. I'm actually gonna finish off this recording session right about now. What is that? Anyway, yeah. Finishing off this recording session right about now. So, I've still got some other stuff i got to record, and I'm auditioning people tonight, so... Yeah, time is not on my side today. So, anyway. Keep enjoying the videos, and subscribe to help the channel, and see more.